I bet you're curious what's going to happen in the housing market in 2023. If you are, keep watching. My name is David, this is LaVon, and on today's episode, we're gonna showcase what the housing experts are predicting for not only mortgage rates, right? Mm -hmm. But house prices moving forward into next year. So our first chart today is gonna to cover what experts are predicting for mortgage rates. Okay, our first chart is a mortgage rate projections chart. Here we have the four major institutions giving their forecast on mortgage rates for 2023. We have Freddie Mac, Fannie Mae, the Mortgage Banker Association, the National Association of Realtors, and their predictions are that rates will slowly decline over the next four quarters of 2023, all the way down to 6% by the fourth quarter. Well, I'm sure that's a pretty sight to see for a lot of buyers out there who are considering purchasing a home next year. Uh, a lot of them might have been spooked by the high climate rates in 2022. So if they continue to drop into 2023, uh, that's a very good sign for all of you. Next, let's look at what experts are predicting home prices to do next year. On the next chart here, we have forecasts from seven major institutions, and they've all put out their figures of where they think home prices are going to go in 2023. Starting at the top, highest one here is Realtor.com. They think it's 5.4% price appreciation in 2023. Next is HPES, which is the Home Price Expectation Survey. They anticipated modest 2.6% gain. National Association of Realtors, 1.2%. Mortgage Bankers Association, relatively flat at 0.7. Freddie Mac, a negative of 0.2. Fannie Mae, at negative 1.5. And the biggest downer on the chart here is Ivy Zellman. She predicts a decline of 5% in home prices in 2023. On the average here, if you average all those out, it's a relatively flat year, just a 0.4% growth. I guess that's also a good thing for home buyers. They're not gonna see a spikes uh, in prices like we did in 2020 and 2022. So good opportunity to get into the housing market next year. More good news from our chief economist, Mark Fleming from First American. The housing market, once adjusted to the new normal of higher mortgage rates, will benefit from continued strong demographic, driven mm. demand relative to an overall long run shortage of supply. So there's two pieces of that quote that I get out of that quote. It's, he says the housing market once adjusted to the new normal of higher mortgage rates. And I, I take that as rates need to stabilize. And if they're, if once they do, and they're starting to for a long period of time, uh, buyers will be adjusted to it and be able to jump back in the market. Uh, this last six months was really abnormal because rates doubled. There's so much uncertainty and confusion about what's going on in the marketplace. And when there's uncertainty and confusion, people just sit on their hands and don't do anything. So I think over time, once things stabilize, buyers are going to be more comfortable uh, predicting the future. They know where their, their things are going to go, where the housing market is going to go. So uh, the second part of the quote here, he says, we will benefit from continued strong demographic driven demand. What that means is uh, all the millennials in, in entering the marketplace. So the, the people who are 32 to like 35 to 25 years old right now, they're entering their peak buying uh, ages. Um, and an interesting stat is um, there's more buyers turning 32 years of age in 2023 than ever in history. So there's all these people turning 32, which is like the prime buying home buying age. So uh, that's what he said. There's going to be continued strong demand uh, moving forward into 2023 and 2024. So that's what the experts think. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? We'd love to hear from you. Comment below. Thanks for watching, you guys. If you found us on YouTube, hit that subscribe button right down below and look for more of our videos. We'll see you on the next one.